So I am going to um, teach about the um, sharing settings. If you go to um, setup and then uh, left side menu, you can type here sharing settings, but I'm not going to do that. At the very under uh, session setting right below that you have sharing settings here so it is under the security sharing setting this is the sharing settings screen so i'll make it larger zoom it out so you that you can uh, view it clearly so these are the org white details so this is how you give access beyond the profile level if profile says for example cont uh, odd object here you don't have access for a profile that profile doesn't have any access right um, so if the profile says um, read write so then you can um, uh, open up on records so sharing settings are for record level the profiles and permission sets are object level that means for all the records at object level so you can open up uh, visibility through sharing settings but you can you cannot narrow it down you can open up um, beyond the profiles and permission sets so this is how you edit it so I have a, an ob, object called authorization form. Right now it's private. So some are controlled by parents. So it in, that means the parent uh, provides access to the child object. In, child ob, records inherit the security from the parent. These are the sharing settings. If I want to, if you want to change like work plan, if you want to change read only, make it read only and save it. So these are the sharing settings. When you go down below the um, object sharing settings you can see other features manager group secure user record access manager group means um, if enabled users can share records with their managers and managers and subordinates secure guest user record keeping this Setting enabled is a security best practice. Secure the access that guest users uh, have to your org data. Guest users org by default are set to the private. Uh, so guest user means uh, experienced cloud users. The next option is Require permission to view record name in lookup fields. To view record names in lookup field, users must have read access to these records to view all lookup record name permission. This requirement also applies to the record name system fields such as created by last modified. Keeping this setting enabled is a security best practice. So these are the. So you can enable 
require permission here yeah, right now it is not enable or check because this is a developer org these are the sharing rules if you go down each object has sharing rules here let's see problem sharing rules there is an object or problem I can create a sharing rules based on the sharing rules open up you can open up the visibility uh, well, I just uh, name me set test select the records to be shared public groups all internal users roles you can select the roles roles and subordinates so if I select that um, all the users in this role uh, sales and marketing and in the hierarchy downwards can access that select the select the users to share with third one uh, select the level of access for the users is read only I will make it read right it's a sharing rule here so uh, so these are the owned by members and then um, so this is a share with so I'm going to share with SCP customer service and support that means this sharing rules the records owned by SCP sales and marketing record hierarchy will be shared with this SCP customer service and support hierarchy so access level and read write this is a sharing rule you have to understand is a base it's a basic feature of Salesforce 